In blackjack, you have the option to split any matched pair of cards into two hands and double your bet. However, this isn't always the best option. To know whether or not to split your pairs, pay attention to which cards are in your hand, as well as the dealer's hand. Some types of pairs should be split no matter what the dealer is holding. For instance, it's always a good idea to split a pair of aces. With a split pair of aces, you can get a 21 with either hand, if you get a 10 or any face card. You'll also get a much better chance at a good hand if you split a pair of eights. If you happen to get a second pair of aces or eights, take the opportunity to triple your bet and split again. On the other hand, there are some pairs where the dealer's hand should factor into your decision to split. For example, if you have a pair of twos, threes, or sevens, it's a good idea to split if the dealer shows a seven or lower. However, if the dealer shows an eight or higher, don't bother splitting. Similarly, it's best to split sixes if the dealer shows a two through six, but not if they have a seven or higher. Split nines if the dealer has a two through six, an eight, or a nine but not if they have a 7, a 10, or an ace. Finally, there are some pairs you should never split. A pair of 10s on its own is a good hand, and you have a much lower chance of making a better one if you split the pair. Likewise, a pair of 5s is a strong starting hand that you'll only weaken by splitting it. Stay away from splitting 4s too. You'll likely just end up with two weak hands.